Hey y'all, it's me, Alex. Today I'm gonna do a little get ready with me video because this is, I just really, really wanted to film in my new location in my dorm room, which is, yeah, it's all this good. Uh, so anyway, let's get started. I'm just gonna do like a quick little daytime look because I'm going to employee training. I'm gonna use this Physicians Formula Super BB in light medium. Which I'm, by the way, I'm still working on getting the lighting because, like, seriously, the fluorescent lighting in this place is... Mm. Yeah, I have student employee training today, and I'm very excited because I always go back early to school to help out with, like, welcome week and welcoming all the freshmen. And I work at, my work study is um, intercultural programs, so we do all the, like, the gay pride stuff for, like, the, or the Black History Month stuff. And I really, really love my work a lot. So, and this year I'm taking on a little bit more, like, responsibility of helping, like, the younger kid, um, the younger students plan events instead of planning events myself, which I'm very excited about because it's a little bit less... Well, I mean, I know I have other responsibilities, but like, it's less stress on me. <laughs> I'm just gonna blend this in with a beauty blender because I can't tell whether or not, like how far, how well it's blended in. So I'll just see. Hopefully this will actually look good on the camera because I can't quite tell yet. Uh, And stop rolling around. I'm gonna use my NYX HD concealer in the shade of light to do my under eye circles. Also, I'm helping out with the 401 skit, which is basically like how, like a little skit on how we like do things at Shenandoah and helping the freshmen get like acquainted with all that stuff. I'm just really, really happy to be back on campus because I have so many friends that I've missed. I'm going to go in with my NYX eyeshadow base in the shade. I think it's nude. I know it's not nude for everyone, so they really shouldn't call it that. But okay, let's roll with it. And I'm going to use my Too Faced Cat Eyes palette because, although I've never mentioned it in a video before, it is probably my favorite ever. I'm going to have to use a little mirror in this. But it is just so good and so versatile. Like, I, like normally I don't do, like, browns or any, like, normal colors, but this one is, like, like, I love these. I love the browns and the... Yeah. I'm using the shade Tiger's Eye right now. And I'm putting the shade Leopard on my outer. And we'll blend that. My makeup looks are always ones that start out looking bad, but they end up looking really good. And I'm gonna take my little fluffy highlighty brush and I'm gonna use the shade Purr. I like these because they're natural, but like shimmery, so they're fun. I'm 
And I'll just dust the shade Tiger's Eye onto my lower lashes. Actually, I think I'll mix it up a little bit. I'll use the shade Pussycat. Kind of give a little visual interest there. I like how that looks. Like, I don't know if you can see it really well on the camera or not because of the lighting, but I like how that looks. Good for me for being creative on this one. Yay. There's my highlighter. And I'm going to use my. Milani Easy Liner in Black to just kind of define my lower lashes. about makeup. That's why I do this. And I'm gonna curl my lashes. And mascara on oh, Physician's Formula Sexy Booster Cat Eyes Mascara. I'm looking to try out some new stuff. I just, this is my go-to foundation right now because foundation. This is my go-to mascara right now because I don't really have a lot of other options because I'm broke at the moment. Like once I actually start getting paychecks for my work, then I'll be able to go try some new ones. So if you have any good like cruelty-free recommendations, let me know in the comments section. I'm also looking to find a good um, cruelty-free liquid foundation that's good for like combo oily skin that has my skin tone because I have a really awkward skin tone to find like I have the weird in between light and medium and I have a cool undertones and so that makes everything just like what for me so yeah and on the lower lash line I'm gonna use the NYX Doll Eyes mascara I'm thinking I might splurge and get the um the new Too Faced Born This Way foundation because I have not seen a review of it that wasn't positive and they were all like genuine from people that I actually trust. It wasn't like some, well, you know from my, from one of my other videos what I could be talking about. Now I think I'll just take some of my Bare Minerals, not Binerals, um, foundation and kind of do that under my eyes and tease them and that stuff because I was going to reach for my powder but I don't feel like that and I'm going to use my Real Techniques brush which by the way I found out that they sell in China so they are not cruelty free like I thought so I'm also going to have to look for some new brushes which makes me sad because these are so good Now for the contour shade, I'm going to take my City Color Contour FX palette and use that contouring shade and just do that in my cheekbones so that my cheekbones look a little less dead, like in the hollows of my cheeks. The deathly hollows. That's not how it was. It was in the book, but you know. Order of the Phoenix is my favorite. Well, my favorite movie, my favorite book was Goblet of Fire. Because seriously, they messed up that movie so bad. And they, honestly, I think they messed up Order of the Phoenix pretty bad, but I actually enjoy that one. Oh, and the bronzer I'm using is My Physician's Formula um, Mineral Wear Talc Free Bronzer. My highlighter, NYX Illuminator, and Ritualistic. 
And to the cheekbones you go. And I might dust a little bit of bronzer on my forehead, which you can barely see because bangs. But, and I intend for very few people to ever really see my forehead. I might just get like the icing brushes because I know they're cruelty free and I'm using their big buffing powder brush to kind of blend everything in. And I actually have to grab something for my purse for my lipstick. I'm gonna use the NYX Eyebrow Cake Powder in the shade Taupe Ash because I don't know how to do like all the cool Instagram brow stuff. Which, if anybody knows how to do that, you should teach me. Like, no YouTuber Pinterest tutorial has done me well yet. I need help. Let me see what my face looks right now because I can't tell if my eyebrows. Okay, they look natural, yay. And on my lips, my mom just gave this to me because it didn't work for her. That's how things work with us. Like, if she tries to make up something or other that doesn't work for her, she just gives it to me. Um, I'm using the Milani lips, their um, regular lipstick in the shade Blushing Beauty. Mm -hmm. That was an attractive noise. And there we have it. It's so pretty. So anyway, that's all for this video. Um, please give me a thumbs up if you like it. Please share down below some good recommendations for like mascara and like a cruelty-free liquid foundation because I am gonna try that. And I and if you want to see more videos like this, be sure to subscribe to my channel. And I will see y'all in my next video. I hope y'all have a wonderful day. Bye.